Adelin's a bespoke team wear and apparel brands, primarily focus on team sport. Customer base tends to be schools, community sports clubs, professional sports teams. Customers are as are based in Australia, New Zealand, the USA. Product base ranges from sports uniforms, and then there's a whole range of off-field apparel for players, for supporters, for coaches, for staff. Basically the whole range of apparel and products that the team needs. One of the main challenges we had prior to introducing 3D technology was when creating customer mock-ups, it's quite often difficult to convey the actual design that you're going to achieve in the end product. So having the 3D technology in place created a much more accurate representation to our customers at mock-up stage, the accuracy of what we present to them versus what the finished garment ends up at. Also, the ability for us to design in 2D or 3D simultaneously is, is huge because it saves so much time for us to be able to provide the factory with the 2D pattern templates that it requires for production, while at the same time providing the 3D garment images that the customer wants to see. Browse where, as opposed to another 3D technology company, the fact that we could modify the software to suit our particular needs was a massive incentive and also the ability to create our own templates and incorporate all the various options that we require for our very specific bespoke garments. Also, the training and technical support offered by Browsewear is excellent. It allows our teams to experiment with new ideas that work best for our particular needs. Browsewear has become our day-to-day -day system for all aspects of our design process, from client mock-ups through to the creation of tech packs and through to demonstrating styles and collections to our customers. So one of the major measurable impacts is the ability of our product development team to create initial patterns within the browser system. Typically, an old way of doing things would take us three to four months. Using the 3D technology first before issuing the samples probably cuts that down in half to around two months. There's also the waste savings of not having had to make multiple samples. Using the old traditional method could maybe take five or six iterations, whereas using a 3D technology, that can be reduced to as little as one or two. The 3D technology allows us to experiment with fit and form. We operate with quite a lot of collar combinations. For example, a rugby jersey might have 15 different collar options. And if we're developing a new collar, we can make the adjustments needed within the software without having to issue samples initially. From the experience of our designers, the 3D technology provides a much more exciting environment in which to work and a lot more possibilities to express their creativity. One of the main things our designers like within Browsewear is the smart design feature, which allows them to take one pattern block and create multiple features around it and not have to recreate the wheel every time they want to change the design feature. Using Browsewear for the last few years has built up a huge collection of design libraries. We want to use those libraries to create a design your own system. Prospective customers can go online or into an app, take those designs and choose their own colors and choose their own features and be able ultimately to order online directly what they've designed. Looking at 3D technology can be quite daunting and there's a lot of time and effort involved in transitioning to the 3D technology. But once it's done, it's quite a rewarding and uh, beneficial experience.